Yesterday, we had a little uh, computer mishap. Well, I had a computer mishap. For some reason, my sound disappeared. I apologize. We had to figure out things a little differently. That's why you see me from all the way from San Francisco. I decided to travel. Why not? Anyway, to keep this short, my name is Susie. This is LB Craft Shows. We have another wonderful holiday edition. So sit back, relax, shop, enjoy. Great group of presenters. Like us, share us, all the good stuff. We'll talk in a little bit. I want to get this started. So, um, Casuary, go ahead. It's all you. Hello, I'm Casuary with Lovely Things. And today is the holiday edition, but I wanted to share some gifts that I have that, or some products that I have that make great gifts. So, the first thing I wanted to show you, since it's Self Care Sunday, is a bath rituals kit. Um, I put together a little instruction card. It comes with an organza bag and um, dried organic flowers to put the essential oils into your bath, as well as salts, a candle, and um, an amethyst and rose quartz tumble and a candle stand. So those are great gifts at only $7 each. And I also have um, more self-care products that are great gifts. I have these uh, crystal face roller wands. They're really great for stimulating the blood circulation to help your skin look healthy and young. I've also got um, a few different of these really cool mirror compacts. And these make great stocking stuffers. They're only $5 each. And of course you need a candle or incense. So I've got you covered there. Um, this is a protection lit rituals candles and it has, it comes with a crystal. It has, it's made with soy and has a wood wick um, and it has the dried flowers in there as well. So I have also a uh, palm stones. This one here is rose quartz. Um, they range in price from between $5 and about $15, depending on the size and the stone, because they have different options available. And I also have a couple of these um, gusha, I hope I'm saying it right, um, massage wands. And um, the other thing I wanted to share. I'm sorry, Adeva. You're good. You're good. I wanted to change the view to speaker view because we see everybody. Um, Lorraine, can you change says, that? It says speaker view online. I don't know what else to do. On the top right on the computer. Yep, I can send you a picture of it. Sorry about that, guys. We are really having a hard time today. I see everybody. Do you see everybody or do you see just one person right now? My view is always a little bit weird, so I'm not sure what everyone else is seeing. We're good now? Okay, they say we're good now. Okay, uh, so sorry about that, guys. Um, so I also have these agate earrings, and agate's really good for concentration, mental clarity. Um, it's a great one to use, like if you're studying. So it's perfect to put it on your earrings on your head to help um, with your concentration during the day. Um, so those start at five dollars, and then um, I did put together some special holiday products. So. I have Christmas ornaments. Um, I made all of these designs. This one here says believe in magic and they all have a crystal so that you can also charm your Christmas tree um, or you can hang them on your door. Um, and these ones are $15. And this one here is the opalite. So I have them in, in different colors. They're all just a little bit different. Um, 
with the, the way that they're painted or the ribbons. And I even have some that are, have, you know, the traditional red and white instead of like the Tiffany blue. So those are a couple that I have. I also have um, these ones. And it says in a flurry with a little snowflake and it has the crystal hanging from these ones as well. These ones are $15. And um, you can see again, they're different. They're not all the same, but the great thing about the different shapes of the ornaments and the different designs is that they are all mix and match. So they don't have to all be exactly the same, but the color schemes go together. So you can make your tree a little bit brighter if you've got more than one. And I have I have some heart ones. These ones say love. Oops, there we go. Another one here. And I even have a few with the moon cycles. And they all have the crystal as well. And the last thing I'll share for right now is I also have these little brooches with the crystal hanging from them. This one in particular is special for me as my wedding anniversary. My first wedding anniversary is next week. And I was supposed to have my wedding during COVID, but we all know what happened there. These ribbons were actually all supposed to be um, for my wedding, but since that's not happening now, I decided to make them into these cute little crystal brooches. And I also have um, hair bows in the same style. So another great stocking stuffer. Um, and those range from um, 10 to $15 as well. So I um, forgot to grab my paper for my information, but I'll be sure to post that in the feed and I'll make sure I have that for the final round. Thanks, Susie. Awesome, and I'm really sorry that for most of your presentation, they saw everybody, they saw you too, they just saw you smaller, so they may have not seen everything. So if you guys missed something and you like what you heard and you wanted to reshow it in a second round, please post it on the feed and we'll make sure you get to see it again. And apologies, like I said, for some reason, the sound of my computer stopped working and so we had to shift gears and I had to start streaming this with uh, Lorraine and Roseanne's help and um, I'm on my phone and I've never done this on my phone and so um, here we are at least here we are so yeah, no great job I love how cozy you look today I think it was for self-care Sunday so. I did not know that that's it today I guess I should have done <laughs> oh well here I have Doreen's uh, socks on Ooh, she okay. sold them at the at the um I don't know if you can see them she sold them at the last show. Yeah. They're really cozy since it's so cold now. So there you go. That's my self-care Sunday. Warm socks. Yay. <laughs> All right. From Casualty, we are tuning over to Wayne. Wayne, go ahead. Unmute yourself. And Casualty, please mute yourself. Morning, everybody. I'm Wayne. I'm with, uh, I do all my own crafts here. I'm with Handicrafts. I do Handy Caddies. I, my email is down there. Please email me or text me. Uh, I do take PayPal, Square, and cash for the payments. I do do deliveries within the Las Vegas area. Outside Las Vegas area is $5 for shipping. So what we got today, we, this is patriotic and holiday week. I've got some here, nice little handy caddies here, nice little glittery one with snowmen on it. What these handy caddies do, you can put everything inside of it. You can take your drink bottle and put it inside and it'll hang right on your arm, arm of your chair. <clears throat> to go, keep going with a little bit of the Christmas. For those that like plaid, we got snow snowflakes with plaid. Very nice. They got a one pound sandbag on the top. They got a little skid plate on the back so it doesn't fall off of anything. Do not throw these in your washing machine because gentlemen, your wife will get mad at you if you put these in the washing machine. You will have sand all over the place. Uh, Santa asked me last time, you don't have one with me and Rudolph. Well, look what I found. 
I've got Santa Claus with the reindeer on a bag. I was able to find it. They're starting to come back with craft material. That's uh, Frosty and Santa. And of course, you got to have a snowman on skis going down the slopes. They'll be on Mount Charleston, probably, the weather keeps up, probably be snowing up there this week. And for all the people with the puppies, you got to have the puppy dogs. Got to have the puppy dogs. And those that like to do yoga, there's your goats. We have goats. Keeps everybody going. And if you like me, I like my little red truck. Got to have the little red truck ones. Now, just so that you all know, is they're normally $15. From now until Christmas, all the bags are $10 a piece between now and the 24th of December. Now to go on with Veterans Day, we do have ones for the military. There's ones for the Air Force. We have the Army, Marine Corps, Guys from the rings ought to get excited for those. These make good stocking stuffers too, guys, because they will just fold up and go right into your stocking. There's the Navy. And of course, we cannot forget the Coast Guard. I do have a couple other things I'd like to present if I may, if I have a little bit of time. I'm into making these little hand handles here for your uh, Hydroflask bottles. They got to have the little lip on it on the Hydroflask, but they just sit on there and they hold on. So you got a handle for your Hydroflask bottle. These are $7 a piece. I've got them for sports teams. I got them for military. I've got them for any color you'd like. I could probably get the, get the rope for it. These are made of paracord. They're not going to break. And for the kids, you can take it apart and hook it onto their backpacks. Now, during the surprise round, I'm gonna have a different item to show you all that my sister sent me. She said, if you could, please present it on the show for me. She's computer illiterate. Uh, so that's all I have right now. Again, their bags are on sale this between now and Chris, Christmas Eve for $10 each. They're normally 15. There's my information, my email there, my cell phone, and I do accept PayPal, uh, Square and Cash. That's all I got for right now. Susie, I'll have the surprise when you come back. Love it. Those are really cool. And I love the designs that you have. Really cool designs and a really great idea too. And can't wait what else you have to, to show us. So absolutely, please go ahead. Okay, we'll see you then. Um, good. We have some giveaways. We will do them a little bit later in the show, but we definitely have two giveaways. I posted the picture this morning, I think. One is an ornament that Cheryl and Mikey are donating, a beautiful snowman. And then um, the other one is a pumpkin, um, a, a, a fall pumpkin from Cindy, uh, Cynthia, who couldn't be here today. So, But she wanted to donate anyway, which I think is really sweet that she did that. Good. Well, speaking of ornaments and Cheryl, and Cheryl and Mikey, why don't you guys take it over? Here you go. Unmute yourself, please. Hello, everybody. Hello. It's Mike and Cheryl with Hendrick Studios. Hope everybody's doing good today. Let me go ahead and show our info here at the beginning. Please take a screenshot so you have the information. all different ways to contact us if you have any questions or if you have any custom things you might want. And we accept uh, payment through uh, Square. Any plastic or debit will work with them. Um, and we deliver free locally or... Uh, oh, what's this shipping? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, disaster has befallen Hendrix Studios. We had a power outage last night and the kiln stopped working. So all the new stuff we had planned did not make it. We still have a few new things, but not nearly the amount we So our bridge from yesterday, no. Not quite as good. <laughs> so, so anyway, good. we're gonna go ahead and start out with our favorite gnomes. Everybody loves these gnomes. We've got transparent reds, got greens, 
All the ornaments come with a bow with a little jingle bell on the top of it, so, but they just don't show well on the cards. They tend to cover up the actual glass. So know that they're just not a piece of glass that's coming to you. This little guy right here, he's almost Raider colors. He's gray, silver, and black. Then our bigger gnome. All our prices range between $12 and $30. That includes shipping for the ornaments. These are absolute awesome trains. These are a different batch than last time. Oh, that was moving. No, you got it, you're good. Nice transparent red, absolutely stunning. You throw the green one, you know? The green, and all those sparkly parts, that's dichroic glass. Let me see if I can get a good glint. Yeah, let's come across. There's a nice yellow. That's a grayish purple. And that's just a dark gray, just a nice gray tree. All this decoration has been painted on and um, the connector parts here are usually a, a twisted cane. that's usually two colors twisted in a spiral. We have our Stars of David. As you can see, the hangers get in the way of the ornaments for yeah, viewing, so that's, that's why, why usually, they're not on. We don't usually put hangers on. Uh, we have a dichroic and a non-dichroic. And a third dichroic. And we're making some of those in white. They just didn't survive the kiln run, sorry. And melted snowmen with the purple hat. Susie, I need you to pick a melted snowman because I would choose the one I like and that might not be your fave. So I'm going to send you the photos of all the ones with purple hats, okay? Purple hats, lots of different purples. That was our big request this year, more purple. And that's kind of cool because purple glass to get that color is actually made with gold. So you have good taste if you like purple. Yay, and it's a royalty color. Okay, here's a few of the new things that from last week. We have the snow globe. Love this look. Very pretty. The little sparklies are dichroic glass. The little strip here is dichroic glass. It's a little zigzag. We have a Santa head. I love him. He's adorable. Those also were in the kill run. Yeah, I had a bunch of those in there. Do, do, do. And of course, lovely blue round ornament. And all the little sparkles are dichroic, uh, little chips of glass. With a nice little snowflake. Real briefly, as I was talking about uh, the history of glass ornaments, started just a little over 400 years ago in Germany. People used to give apples as gifts and a gentleman named Hans Greiner, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, Susie, didn't have money, but was a glass maker and was able to produce glass apples to give to his family and friends. That tradition carried on a little bit, but not so much until about actually 250 years later, when a man named Hans Greiner, yes, a descendant of his, and another one named Larry Mueller started making what was called silvered glass ornaments or mercury glass. Obviously, that didn't last too long as it's incredibly toxic and people died from those. But the traditional shapes are an apple, an evergreen tree, a star, and a bell, and an angel. And those were given for, like I say, decades. So, and so here's a little gingerbread house. Very pretty. Can also be worn as a pendant. All these can be worn as pendants as demonstrated here. I got a little Christmas tree, dichroic, very pretty. Also, while we're on the subject of wearing some of this glass, I want you to see how thick this glass is. This glass is about a quarter inch thick. It's not gonna break when you wear it. It may not break when you drop it. I've dropped them several times. I have um, tile floor and it destroys everything, including corral plates. It has not hurt my glass. Last thing I wanted to show was this poinsettia. It's very nice, red transparent, and opaque. 
and some green transparent. Okay, thanks very much. We ran a little bit over, but here's our info again. Hendrick Studios, be sure and take that screenshot. If you have any questions or if you have anything you want us to make custom wise, please should be sure and let us know. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Take care and we'll see you in the surprise round. Bye bye. I liked those and it's Hans, but that's fine. Hans, Hans, close enough. Hans, 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 Hans yeah. Thank you. It's German. Hans is a very, very popular name in Germany and Austria too. Hans, Hansi. Um, cool. At, at the gingerbread house is really, really cute. So let me ask this Santa, are you oh, there? Oh, oh. Well, I just wanted to pop in here and say hello to everybody. And, Hi, Santa. and the, the presentation so far have gone wonderful. I, I really love uh, Kazang, your, your, your crystals, and I love the ornament with the crystal that says magic belief. Be beautiful, beautiful. And, and of course, the bags. Oh my gosh. I, those, you finally found something, Mike, for me to have with, with reindeer and Santa. I love it, I love it, I love it. And of course, the ornaments. Oh my gosh. The trains are gorgeous. The, the, the snow globe, oh boy, I tell you, you guys have gone over and above compared to whatever else we can make at the North Pole. I'm going to have to send my elves down next year and have them start to train with you guys. Yes, we'll be happy to give some classes for those guys. Because they need classes in, in, in making all these different wonderful things. And, awesome. and I know for a fact the next two presenters have got things that are going to knock my socks off. Yes, or should I say, my blades on my sleigh. Ho, ho, ho! It's Santa, live from the North Pole. You can see me at www.santa01.com and book your, book your virtual visit there. Ho, ho, ho! Chat later about that. Bye-bye. Thanks, Susie. Well, we're glad you're back. We know you had a little uh, um, emergency yesterday and we were all sending our thoughts and prayers your way and glad that things are better. And um, if you guys missed yesterday's show, there was a lot of stuff with Christmas stuff and also with Santa and elves. And Karen made um, some ceramic plates that have a reindeer in the middle of it but it's like it's not painted on there it's actually on there I, I, I don't know how to describe it you got to look at that I even said I said oh Santa would love that one really really cool so we're glad you're back thank you so much uh, good um, speaking of Karen we have a different Karen today Karen and Linda so why don't you two go ahead and start your first presentation please Good morning. I'm Good morning. Linda. And I'm Karen. And we are Karen's, Karen's Crystal, Crystal Brittles. Brittles. And here's our information. Are we muted? No. <laughs> All right. So before we start, we have a little PowerPoint, but before we start that, we're going to actually show you some of our products. As you know, we offer brittles. We have three different kinds. We have our peanut, which is fluffier and lighter and airier than national brands, not so hard on your teeth. And this is our one pound bag that we sell for 20. This is our no peanut. It is a half pound bag for 11 and our no peanut is like a Butterfinger, honeycomb or sponge candy. So you can see the difference between the one pound and the half pound bags. Both of these products are offered in the half and one pound bag. And then we have brought back our cayenne and what's fun about our cayenne is it starts sweet and then it grows into a medium cayenne kick. So kind of fun. All of our products are homemade, hand packed, and they are heat sealed and keep for at least six months. The other product line we offer are our crumb jars. What we do is we save our crumbs after we pack our brittle and we package it into these crumb jars and we have them for all holidays. We've even branched out to weddings and birthday parties. But so these are a couple of our fall crumb jars. You can see this one has our no peanut crumbs and this one has our peanut crumbs. 
And they all come with a tag on the back that states that they're for ice cream toppings, yogurt or granola or straight brittle shots out of the jar. So we just wanted to show you a couple samples. All of these so far are $8. This is our smaller size for $8. And then these last two we're gonna show you are our larger size for 15, two different jar types. This one says Merry Christmas. They're, they're pretty heavy. They have a lot of candy in them. And then with that, um, we're gonna ask that you get ready to either take a screenshot or get a pencil of paper and jot down the number of our product. If you see anything you would like to purchase, we do offer free local delivery. For a minimum of a $31 order. So here you can see all the areas that we deliver. We do not offer shipping, but we offer the free delivery instead. It's very simple to ship, just a sheet of bubble wrap and it fits in one of those flat rate boxes. So we already showed you our three types of brittle, our peanut, our no peanut and our cayenne. And we are in our eighth year of business. So. so you can see up close, especially the picture on the right, that is the backs or the underside of our brittle. You can see it is just packed full of peanuts. And you can see in the middle picture how fluffy and airy it is. Again, 11 for the half pound and 20 for the pound. Our no peanut, this one's also really good with uh, Nutella or chocolate or refrigerated. Again, all of them have a, sh a minimum shelf life of six months. And our cayenne, we just offer the cayenne in the one pound bags and it starts really sweet in your mouth and then just continues to grow into a medium cayenne kick. And then our other product line that we just showed you were our Karen's Crystal Crumbs and then we're gonna start with a, just a few. Believe me, this is just a few of what we have. If you see a jar that you like, each one of our jars has a number. Just go ahead and jot down the number or take a picture. We've had customers uh, take a picture and then just uh, text us the picture, the one they're interested in. So these can be filled with your choice of either peanut or no peanut, or they can also be purchased empty. Um, we've heard that people have put the, the fairy lights or the, the battery operated tea lights in them. They're $8 filled or unfilled. The middle picture is just a combo of the, the little harvest people on the left and right. So we have jar number 115 and 116. Again, the middle is just a combo and their little legs hang over the edge of the jar. We have many different varieties of these. These would make great holiday place settings or a nice hostess gift. Again, we have many, many more. So if you're looking for something, one of the things we did during the pandemic was create an inventory program with the ability to search. So say you're looking for a penguin, which would probably be more for Christmas, then we would be able to bring up a picture and show you all of the penguins and how many we have of each. So with that, we're gonna move into our Christmas line or just a, a minimal portion of our Christmas line. You also can customize the jars for any of the holidays or occasions. These are examples of custom orders that we did. To customize is an additional $2. If you wanted it to say something else on the back, you could do that as well. And it would still be just a total of $2, not $4. So again, if you're just joining us, please either take a screenshot or jot down the number of the jar if you're interested. You have a choice to have them with peanut, no peanut or unfilled. And you will notice the jars are out of order because we shortened the presentation down from the meet the VIP and then threw in a couple additional things. These are really popular items and the scarves hang out or kind of go out in front of the jar. Now this one, his little head bobbles just a, a tiny bit. And this one says, tis the season, but you can see on the right, you can also have the, the little snowman with the following sayings on the right. We have just a couple of each. So if you're interested, contact us soon. Little trilogy here of, no men. This is popular.
And then we go into our larger size jars that we showed you before this PowerPoint. These are our, our some of the jars say Merry Christmas on the front. These particular ones, of course, have Santa on the front. And then we have the little globes on the top of these. So these are jar numbers 34 and 35. They're a little bit different. And these are still our large jars at 15. We're gonna head into our tree crumb jars. This is another one that's been very popular is our little uh, acrylic tree. We're back to our small size of, of jars and then two of our larger sizes. Now the great, and actually these two, some of them will only fit on a large jar, but these trees will fit on a small jar as well. So this one we could do in the eight jar, $8 jar as well. And the tree comes in silver and gold. And as you see, you could put a name tag in there for a place setting or a little card, or as we've shown it with a gift card. So you, you kind of, you get the jar, you get the candy, you can have an extra treat in top on the top. And then this is one of our large Christmas tree jars, the $15 jar, peppermint tree. On to our Santa jars, <laughs> our cowboy Santa, old fashioned Santa. And these are a little bit different in that they have a smaller Santa on the front and then they have a decoration on the front of the jar. It's a little bit different than how we decorate most of our jars. And then our more traditional Santas and these are our larger jars that we showed you. So they have a lot more candy. Again, your choice of peanut, no peanut or unfilled. And our last, last ones for the Santas. Our Christmas animals, our Christmas birds, jars number 55 and 56. I'm going quickly because we're at time. This is offered at many other, and then I'm just going to go super fast because we're at the end of our time. <laughs> All right, and then I'm going to go ahead and give you our contact information. Let me stop sharing. I thought I cut enough, but I didn't. So there's our contact information. Thank you, Susie. All right, I look like I'm frozen. Can you hear me? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, yes. just look at my frozen picture. On the upside, my computer just fixed itself. Sound came back. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> it rebooted. When in doubt, and I should have known that, when in doubt, reboot. But anyway, I love the brittle. I love those brittle crumb jars in the ones with the Christmas tree and um, where you can see the, the, the card on top, put the card on top, totally adorable. But I'm going to turn it over to the next uh, presentation, which is now your other company, so that you don't have to stare at my frozen face. There you go. <laughs> I'm Linda. I'm Karen. <laughs> We're the Stuffy Ladies. This is our new company. It's just about a year old now. And for those of you who already know our products, we sell stuffies and they are not only an ornament with a hanger, but they also have a detachable gift card pouch in the back, which I forgot to pull a gift card for this morning. This one is different. We haven't shown this one before. It's really cute because it has nice on one side and then you can flip it over and it has naughty on the other side. And again, gift card pouch on the back. And we also have our door hangers. These did really well at our show last weekend and we put a pouch on the back of them as well. And finally, we are selling our masks. I'll just quickly show you. We have a Thanksgiving and then several different varieties, including dogs and Santas and trees and peppermint for our face masks. And with that, we're gonna go ahead and show you some of our stuffies. Again, either screenshot or take a jot down the number. 
So some other uses for our stuffies, they not only can hold a gift card, they, a lot of people buy them and set them on their counter or their or in the kitchen as Christmas decorations, tooth fairy, secret Santa gifts, the, the endless, there's endless possibilities. So this is what the gift card looks like in the pouch. I forgot to set one out this morning. It fits it perfectly. We also offer customization on our pouches for an additional $2 as you see on the left, but we do switch out for Hanukkah or breast cancer pouches free of charge. Here's some examples of some more personalized pouches for only $2. So here's just a few of our holiday stuffies for Thanksgiving. So here we have stuffy 54 and 55. This is, these would be the pouches they come with unless you choose to switch it out for the Hanukkah. Or we probably wouldn't do Hanukkah for this, but breast cancer, or you would like a customized pouch for $2. I'm trying to go faster this time. Six minutes goes by really fast. She's all decked out in her pearls. And then we're gonna move into just a small portion of our stuffies. This is one of our few stuffies that has the pouch in the front. Santa's one of our very popular ones. These sell out quickly. And then you can see most of our stuffies have the pouch on the back. And you can see the hanger. Again, they, they are not in order. And we have this one in red and we have it in green and they have the actual plastic doll head. So that's a little bit different as well. They did really well last weekend too. This one has little Velcro hands so you could actually have it holding a little gift. More traditional elf. It's the perfect 2020 moose. <laughs> All right, moose are super popular. And the, this um, moose, or Karen says it's a reindeer, but we put it in the moose category. It is, I know, I'm just not <laughs> gonna tell her. But this one also has the Velcro paws. This is one of our top sellers, this moose. On to gnomes. This one is new for us this year. If you wanted it decorated in a different color than the light blue, we would be happy to do that for you as well. So if you do see something you like, but you wish it were decorated in a different color or like you wanted this in silver or red or whatever, we're happy to do that for you. Just jot down the number. And then it wouldn't be LV craft shows without the pups. Again, they all have the gift card pouch. I'm going quickly. And our snowmen. Snowmen and moose, top sellers. She's all decked out in her pearls. She's ready. <laughs> top hats. Top hats. This one's really popular too. This is like the Santa one with the pouch on the front. These are our only two with the pouch on the front. People love this one. For whatever <laughs> because reason. it has the dangly legs, I think. And oh, actually this one has the Velcro hands too. And the dangly legs. And the dangly legs. If it has dangly legs, they're in. <laughs> this one has glitter, kind of a glitter finish to it. And then our miscellaneous, our owls, llamas, llamas are big, snowbird, and gingerbread. We This one is in silver. We also have another pair um, like in gold. And then just as a reminder, we do customization for an additional $2. We switch out for Hanukkah or breast cancer, of course, free of charge. And there is our contact information. Thank you, Susie. You wanna show our sign sign? Yes, please do.
Great job, ladies, as always. Oh, oh, oh. Susie, I just had to jump in here. Karen, Linda, wow. Wow, 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 wow. I mean, phenomenal, phenomenal stuff. I, the Santa stuff, the miscellaneous, absolutely wonderful. I do have to say just one thing. Santa is doing all live virtual visits live from the North Pole at www.santa01.com. You go to virtual Santa and you can book a visit with Santa. Unfortunately, Santa is going to have to leave and go on to a Zoom call. So don't forget, go see Santa at www.santa01.com because my season has started and I've got a call in one minute. Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas, ladies and gentlemen, and I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye. Happy holidays. Thank you for joining us, Santa, and glad it's all is well. And I know you're a busy, busy Santa now. All right. Before we move on to our next presenter, let's do a quick giveaway of the beautiful ornament by Cheryl and Mikey. So um, really easy question. Our special guest, Santa, where did he contact us from? The fifth poster, poster number five, will get the prize. Post away. The fifth poster will get the prize. Where did Santa join us from? And while you guys are posting the answer, I am going to turn this over to Jana. Hi. Thanks, Live. Okay, I'm going to start with my information. I am Jana with JNJ Recreations. Jessica is unavailable, but she will be joining us at uh, the 28th at the virtual show, or at the live show. So she'll be there. Uh, we do cash, uh, Square, and Venmo. And I have recently gotten PayPal up and running. So we can do that too. I can do Zelle. So lots of options, easy to do. We're gonna start with some gifts today. So who wouldn't want to feel really pretty? So I've got, I'm gonna start with kind of our young lady. This is freshwater pearl and uh, Swarovski crystals, which is a little bit of rose quartz. It's a very soft, light pink crystal. Our younger girls, because they need to sp feel special too. Pearls are like wearing snowflakes around you or snowballs around your neck. This is pearls um, and rose quartz, which is also great for, for a young girl. Uh, they're $15. And they are real pearls, they are real crystals. A Little bit bigger, these are quite large pearls and crystals. These crystals happen to be orange, which is a lot of fun for Thanksgiving. We just passed up Halloween, so those are a lot of fun. The one I'm wearing is rose quartz and pearls. So you'll see how they fit. They're, uh, most of them are 17 inches. I can put extension chains. The younger ones are 15 inches. And then something just for fun. This is a single strand loop mother of pearl and freshwater pearl. Get my tag out of the way. <laughs> I'm trying to get everything ready for the show the end of the month. So it's just fun. It's festive for fall, great colors. And then if you want to go up a little bit fancier, and these make phenomenal gifts, folks. These are genuine emeralds and sapphires and freshwater pearls. I can add extension chains. Most of these are 17 inches. Let me look at this one real quick. Yeah, they're 17, so they hang just above the notch, your sternal notch. So if you want them a little bit shorter, it's super easy. I know I'm using medical terms. It's super easy to make them shorter. I can make them longer, you know, custom done. This one, this is my last one for now, but I will be making more when I can get some more material. I have to get my, my stones from Brazil. Uh, this is ruby and zoocyte are the green ones, green and pink. And then they're carved ruby hearts with freshwater pearls. These are all genuine stones. Uh, these fancy stone ones are $50. They are pricey, but there is a lot of quality stones in these. 
This one is just emeralds and pearls. So we have, oh, I just dropped them on my foot. We have a lot of options. I dropped myself. <clears throat> okay, so there's the fancy jewelry part. Now we get on to the more functional side of things. You're heading to, oh, I dropped my soap. One sec. Oh, sorry about that. Heading to Thanksgiving, it's at somebody's house. Um, for example, my sister is probably throwing us a Thanksgiving party. This would make an amazing Thanksgiving hostess gift. We have the silicone back hot pad. Nice little pouch for your hand, keeps your hand super safe. Can be totally personalized. We have tons of designs available online. This is a cotton scrubby, great for your nice china. Those light, easy, just need to wipe off type of messes. When you need a little bit heavy duty scrubby, this is our, our poly scrubby, which is it's red heart yarn and it's actually called scrubby. So it's made to scrub things. This one has a soap in it. So it's a little bit bigger because it already has Castile soap, 100% pure Castile soap. So really good for, for dishes, pots and pans and whatnot. Along those lines, we also have Santa belts because Santa's popular, what can you say? Brownie mix spatula, we can put anything in it. You can get it just plain. The hot pad by itself is $7. You can add name, personalization. You can add extra items to it. Along the scrubby line, I have some more of the poly scrubbies, lots of colors to choose from. I'm working on a whole bunch of them for the show. So if you don't see anything right now, come to the show on the 28th. I'll be downstairs in the buffet with, and I will be custom making for you there. Come through, tell me what you want, go upstairs and then come back and pick it up. I'll have them ready for you. So we also have these fun ornament scrubbies. Hang them on your tree, give them as gifts, put them on a package. Great way to do it. It's $4 for the ornament scrubbies. They are single sided, but it's two types of yarn in there. So it's nice and heavy duty. These can literally go in the dishwasher once a week, once a month, depending. I think I do mine about once a month because they don't smell. They dry out so nice and easy. Throw it in the dishwasher in your instrument thing or up on the top rack, the ones with the holes, slip right over the little posts up, up on the top with your glassware. The cotton ones still have the scrubby, but therefore you're a little bit more delicate. You know, if you're using fine china, hand painted china like I do, I'm kind of weird that way, old fashioned. These are fantastic because they won't scratch any of that. And then moving on to face scrubbies. Where's my jar? Face scrubbies, personalized jar. Jessica will personalize it with whatever you want. I've got the nice, soft, fluffy cotton, super soft. Or we have the exfoliating that I can do in lots. This is a swirly pattern. I can do it red and white also. Um, it's all sparkly pretty this they will be double-sided i left them single-sided because i had a couple of requests to put them together different colors so that's another one of the, the options that we'll do here's one double-sided the somebody wanted them together here's one you can do them separate they are a sparkle scrubby yarn polyester they can go in the washing machine not in the dryer they will not do well in the dryer they kind of shrink and get all yucky and not very soft they are soft, but they do scrub. Nice exfoliating, great for taking off that semi-permanent makeup, lip scents and stuff. These are amazing. Okay, you've been out shopping all day because tis the season. Foot soak. This stuff is fantastic. This one happens to be my, my king scent, which is soothe, soothing. Um, Gift of Kings is kind of my own personal blend that I put together of frankincense, myrrh, cinnamon, because those are all items that were used in biblical times and they found that they had really good um, benefits. So I put them all together into a soothe along with a little bit of peppermint tea because that is really good for achy feet. So my little soothe jars. Jessica will personalize them however you want. And then we move into coasters. Gotta have the Santa belt. I will say they're a pain in the butt to make, but they are so cute. I can't help it. I have to make them. So we have Santa belt. And then my newest one, I haven't even buried my, la my tie yet, are my little ornament coasters. And these will come in 
blue, yellow, green, red, and purple at this point. If there's a special color you want, let me know. I'll make it. I have 101 colors. I will do whatever you want. And staying on the bathroom idea, we have soap. Soap. This is our oatmeal. All of my soaps are cleansing crystals. They're in the shape of crystals. So it blends in with all the other crystals that you have if you're into that thing. Um, but they're soaps, so they're cleansing crystals. This one's oatmeal, nothing added. It's just an oatmeal goat's milk. This is my lavender, which has a little bit of all natural mica powder and lavender essential oil. This one is Hawaiian black sea salt. It's the volcanic sea salt. Um, I pulled this one out. This is actually one of my oldest ones. I keep it just kind of as a demo that you can get some discoloration over time. And this one's about two years old, maybe three by now. Um, but it's just some of the salts coming to the surface. So don't freak out about it. Still works really, really well. It's exfoliating as well as it smells really good. This is my favorite. It is kind of a holiday scent. It is cinnamon, rosemary, and I forgot the third oil I put in there. Oh, frankincense. Um, I bet it smells amazing. And it white washes off super clean. This is another black sea salt. So it just kind of shows you some of the different shapes and sizes. They're all four ounces and they fit in my scrubby bags. These are bags that you can put the soap in and use like an exfoliating bag. They're 100% cotton. Stick them in, stick the soap in, give it a little bit of a rub under the water, rub all over, rinse it out, and hang it up on one of those bathroom command hook thingies. Dries in our dry area, they dry out no problem at all. They're also throw them in the washing machine, throw them in the dryer when your bar of soap is done and start over again. But yeah, little hand crocheted baggies, really handy little things. I go to the pool and I needed something to hang on my little hook because I don't like using community soap dishes. That's just kind of it. Um, but they all have hooks in the shower area. So I just hang my little baggie on there. I use it and I take it with me. And it works great, gyms. And once you've done all that, you need to lotion. So I have lotion bars. These are beeswax based, a bar of lotion that you can actually stick in your purse, but they come in a little baggie so they don't get everything sticky because yeah, they are sticky. You simply hold it in your hands, give it a slight rub until it just starts to get sticky. Set it down, vigorously rub your hands together. The shea butter and coconut oil will soak down into your hands. They're all antimicrobial. They come in my king scent, lavender and unscented. For example, here's my little pocket size king scent. It's a little bunk cake. It's a cute little thing. And then this is my massage bar size, my little king's crown. The bees come in a honeycomb beeswax shape. The lavender comes in a flower, you know, just kind of that type of thing. So for this round, I think that'll do us. And then I have something else for later. Lots of variety. Oh, show your info one more time. My info one more time. Oh, sorry, the box. Okay. J and J Recreations, Facebook, uh, Gmail. We take cash, Venmo, Square, and now PayPal as well. So we do do local porch deliveries all over the Las Vegas Valley. If you want custom item, feel free to come to the show and pick it up there. If you want something a little more complex, otherwise we can deliver it to you before then. I know I need to make a sign language chart. You know, I can't hear you. Show your info one more time. Watch your time. Move over. <laughs> great presentation. Great items. You have such big variety. And I'm so excited to see you at the show um, in, at the end of November 28th, 29th at Santa Fe. And Jenna will be inside the... Uh, which day will you be there? 28th in the buffet. She'll be there on Saturday only the 28th inside the buffet area. Wonderful. So we have a winner. The winner of the ornament is Jana Michelle. And I know Jana and uh, Cheryl, they already have been in contact. So you guys hook up with one another and get your ornament. 
wonderful job. Good. We have another giveaway, though. We have, like I said, Cynthia, who couldn't be here today. She's the lady that did this amazing kind of a vintage look of, of all kinds of things. She did those great pumpkins. She did those uh, bottles. Some of them were lit up with different teams and different designs. She had bird feeders, uh, all kinds of stuff, uh, wreaths, uh, signs, you name it. And she couldn't be here, but she wanted to donate a gift. So today um, we're giving away one of the fall pumpkins really really beautiful so to win it if you were here from the beginning you will know this if not you may have to wait till the next pres presenter is done um to win this what did casually say what day is it today and her outfit shows it what day is it today and why is casually wearing what she's wearing so please um post away we will give you a little time and i let casually do her presentation so you can think about it for a second and when she gets started then we'll start counting poster number eight but don't post till she gets started so you can maybe verify all right casually take it away i hope this works well thank you i'm flattered <laughs> um, so I guess I won't say the magic word again. Okay, I won't say it again. Um, but first, let me give you my information since I forgot last time. Um, and I'm on Facebook, Instagram. I also have a website. Um, if we're VIP shopping, go to Facebook or Instagram. And I have lots of new stuff. I'll be doing a lot of live shows off of Facebook and Instagram over the next few days because I have a bunch of new stuff and um, I was at the show so I'm still working on getting it all out there because uh, I also made a bunch of stuff for the show. So continuing along my, my theme, the next item that I wanted to show you were some of the new bracelets that I have. So I made a bunch of bracelets and um, they're all between five and $10, but they're genuine crystals. This one here is lava rock as well as um, rainbow fluorite. And also on my Facebook and um, yeah, on my Facebook, I just posted a, uh, um, a chart that kind of shows you like um, what is in each of the bracelets and what properties it has. So be sure to take a look at that. But I did a bunch in this kind of half and half style because I really wanted to pair some of the energies of the crystals together. So um, you'll see some green banded agate, you'll see some um, moss agate, lava stone, fluorite, all kinds of different combos here. Um, because like I said, I wanted to, to combine the energies. So be sure to check those out. And I and these are great for the magic word I can't say either. <laughs> these have really good energy for uh, taking care of yourself. Um, and then the other thing I want, oh, here it is. So along the same theme, <laughs> another item that I have here is a full tea set. This one comes with um, six cups. So it's like a cute little set for you and your family. And the teapot actually um, has the strainer in it. So you can make your, your fresh teas right in the pot. And this whole set is only $25. So along the same theme, it would be a great gift for someone. Um, and I feel like I'm forgetting something. I'm forgetting something, but that's okay. Um, the last thing I wanted to share is I do have a couple of these jewelry boxes that would make great gifts. These are $25 and um, they actually come with the key, but the cool thing about these is when you open it, I'm just, there we go. When you open it, the bottom drawer slides automatically out. So this would be a great place to keep some of your special crystals or some of your crystal jewelry um, to keep it safe. And one last time, I'll share my information, um, facebook.com slash lovely things. Instagram is um, at lovely underscore things LLC and lovely is a play off my married name. So it's spelled L-O-V-E-L-E-E. -E -E. And that's it for today. 
Beautiful. I love it. I love it. All right. Great job. So again, in her first presentation, she mentioned why she's wearing this beautiful bathrobe today because it's a special <laughs> day today. Uh, and no, it's not her anniversary, even though she mentioned that, mentioned that too. It has something to do about yourself. Um, I do see some re responses, even though only a couple actually are saying the the, what she said correctly um, uh, please only post once so there's somebody there posting like seven eight times we want to make sure everybody gets a chance so keep posting and once we have eight different posters then we will announce the winner but we need to have eight different posters good so great job Kazri now going on to Wayne I can't wait what he has to show us he said he has something else so show away Wayne Thank you, Susie. I'm back. Here's my information. Just take a screenshot of it and write me, tell me what you like. These are my, what my sister sent me from Indiana. These are what she calls bag of bags. You pull out the bag at the bottom. If you got puppies, you got a bag to take outside with you when you go. This will hold 20 to 30 bags. It's about 20 inches long and all the bags just stuff in the bottom. She has different colors here, three different styles, and she's got these also. She's got more back in Indiana, but she sends them to me to see if I can do anything out here with them, if anybody likes them. They're $7 a piece, uh, and shipping is free. Here's my information again, and Susie, that's all I got for the day. Those are so cool. I had seen those before a long time ago. We had them at the show sometime. And it's really cool because what do we do? We take a plastic bag just to collect all the plastic bag inside the plastic bags. And it doesn't look good. You usually have it somewhere in the kitchen. So these are really, really cool. You can, you know, pick a different design, something like that, and then just hang them up. It's, you can almost decorate your kitchen with it. So great job. Your sister, you said with those? Did you say your sister did them? Yes, my sister does them back in Indiana. Great job, Wayne's sister. All right, thank you, Wayne. Uh-huh. Oh, I almost muted myself. I shouldn't do that. All right, so one more time. In the first round, uh, um, Casually mentioned a word of what today's day is. Only one person actually got the word right. The other person has a similar word. The others have a similar word. So it was a special special word special it was a, it sounds like this ha 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 good so now you know what it sounds like <laughs> you just have to fill in the letters we take the eighth poster but it has to be eight different posters good and if it takes till after the show then we will we'll take the after the show we will count all the posts <laughs> <laughs> all right i'll shut up now this has been a wacky day today all right cheryl go ahead take it away Hello, everybody. Hello. We're back. I'm going to go ahead and post our info here. First, boom. Be sure and take that screenshot. You good. Show what Jana won. Oh, and let me show what Jana won. This really cute little snowman. Congratulations, Jana. Yes, absolutely. Congratulations. Okay, here at the end, we're gonna show some snowflakes. We're not nearly as good as mother nature, but we make a reasonable attempt. This, it's really hard to see, but it's this very, very pale. Tint of a blue. Tint of a blue. It's not clear. Yeah, it looks clear, but it's just so light blue. It's like ice blue. Very subtle. Very, very subtle. All the snowflakes are about five and a half inches round, square, this white. One's white, nice white one. Pretty. We made two different patterns. This is the second pattern. It has two of the little pokey things on the arm. This one you can see, it's iridescent. So if you notice, you're seeing little hints of blue and a couple other little colors. Green and purple. Yeah, that's the iridescent. Okay. All right, and then some not necessarily traditional colors. 
We have a nice blue, very pretty. These work really well as sun catchers. Sun catchers going in the window. There's one with Christmas colors. I think that one's really nice. And if you space it a little a ways away from the wall, they will show the color on the wall. Yes, they will. And this last one, it's, just, on your it's a neo lavender. Unless you have fluorescent lights, then it's a kind of gray blue. Interesting gray blue. So this one color changes in various lighting. I love that one. Very pretty. Okay. One more time. The info. Hendrick Studios, 994-2868. We got an Etsy store. We got a Facebook page. And any questions, anything like that, drop us an email. Okay? Thank you. Thank you so much, everybody. Take care. Be have safe. Have a great Sunday. And have a great Sunday. And we'll see you next Sunday, Saturday. We're next Saturday show. Awesome. Love the sun catcher idea. And it's funny because I'm sitting next to a window and the sun kind of comes in and out. As a matter of fact, even though it's really sunny, some rain just hit my window, but like five raindrops and that's it. It's not measurable. We're still at two, day number 201 or 202 with no rain or something. So sun catchers, great idea. Love that, love that. All right, great job. So again, in the first round, Calgary mentioned a word of what today's day is. Um, some of you posted a similar word. Well, not the word she said. As a matter of fact, there's only one person correct so far. Yes, yeah, see, attention to detail. It pays off. So we'll let you think on it. I know you can't watch it back right now because it's still live. So it sounds like ha 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 ha. So if that helps, that should eliminate the one that keeps posting the incorrect one. If not, we will have a winner. We will announce the winner right at the end of the show. Until then, Karen and Linda, why don't you do your two presentations, your uh, surprise rounds, please? Okay. We are Karen's Crystal Brittles, first of all. <laughs> Here's our information. And this Wednesday is Veterans Day, and we'd like to take this opportunity to thank all of those who serve and have served our country. And in honor of Veterans Day, we are offering two of our crumb jars with Uncle Sam on them. Bears. See the front, they're, yeah, they're Uncle Sam bear. Well, one's Uncle Sam, one's a bear. <laughs> Again, fillable with peanut or no peanut crumbs or unfilled for $8. And then an item we did not get to show, this is new for us, is our Santa bag. And it has 30 pieces of our brittle or no peanut brittle in it. And these are $15 and these were very popular at the show last weekend. So we have just a few of those left. And that is it for the brittle, the peanut brittle. So I'm gonna give you our contact information again. And then our second company. <laughs> Trying to get ahead of the game. The stuffy ladies. You can find us both in the same booth, both companies, big double booth. Again, in honor of Veterans Day this Wednesday, we have our stuffies with the detachable gift card pouches. We have a boy and a girl with the detachable gift card pouches. And this is our last patriotic bear. He's a little bigger, he's really soft and fluffy with the detachable gift card pouch. Great way to honor the veterans we love. And this has a little story behind it. We bought this because you all know we love to decorate our booth. So um, we have a larger ver version of the sign in our booth and we can't tell you how many times people have teared up over it, begged us to sell it to them. And so we're actually gonna start making them next year, but we have just this one and it says, our flag does not fly because the wind moves it. It flies with the last breath of each soldier who died protecting it. And again, we wanna thank all of those who serve our country. Happy Veterans Day. And here is our, and that one is $10. And here is our information again.
Thank you, Susie. And we will be at the two day show at the end of this month. It was, if you didn't come out last week, oh, it was, it was phenomenal. And no one was more afraid than me. And it was, it felt a hundred percent safe. And so please come out and see us. And thank you, Susie, for doing them. Thank you. First of all, that flag thing is totally beautiful. I love what you wrote on there. So that is so cool. And yes, we need to thank uh, all our veterans. And speaking of Veterans Day, uh, we will not have a show on Wednesday because of Veterans Day so that you can um, celebrate the veterans. Uh, we will do a special meet the VIPs on Thursday instead, Thursday 6 30 p.m. we will have another version of Meet the VIPs. Now you may have seen Karen and Linda at our shows before and it's funny because I was just talking to Linda about that when she when they started with us they had like a small eight by four table space at the Silverton at the end they, they always wanted an end spot so they had the eight by four end spot in the first row at the end of the row and then they upgraded to an eight by eight end booth and then as you know, the shows grew, we grew, they grew, everybody grew. They started upgrading to like at the bigger shows to like a 10 by 15 and then upgraded to a 10 by 20. So uh, we have had a couple of people wonder, well, how come the brittle ladies always have a bigger booth than everybody else? Because they okay. buy two <laughs> booths. They pay more than anybody else. So that's why, because they need all the room, they want the extra corner spaces and stuff so that they're, they have a huge following and we want to make sure to keep them safe too, that they have enough access on all sides for the customers to go through the bins, to look at the brittle, to look at the stuffies, and to do their transactions. So there's your answer for those of you that were asking. You and I appreciate both of you and your support. <laughs> Good. So um, let's go to Jana. And then um, one thing, we have Debbie and Mike are the only two that answered correctly. Debbie and Mike, I need you to post the number one or two the number one or two. Now, if you end up posting the same number, then one of you has to change numbers. Post the number one or two. And while you guys post that, Debbie Hiltner that is. Debbie Hiltner and Mike Burns. Debbie Hiltner, Mike Burns, post the number one or two. And Jana, you take it away. Okay, so I've got a couple of things to show you that blitzed. It's Christmas time, it's 2020. Who does not need the virus ornament, right? <laughs> we can also add names to them if you want, but they're just so adorable as it is. It's iridescent glitter on the inside, so they do not get all over your house. That's kind of important because we all know what glitter does. Jessica and I have glitter everywhere. You do it at one house, it spreads. Glitter's just weird. But then we also have a little bit fancier, personalized family name, nice matte ornaments. We have these in, I believe, four colors right now. And Jessica is in the process of making a bunch of new ones. She's got a series of dinosaur ones for the little guys. Well, her son's big into dinosaurs. And then she's got um, some cute little farm animals for those that are in farms. So check out our website. Order ahead of time. We'll have them ready for you at the show. Our dog treat jars can be personalized with the dog's names on the sides. We can change whatever it says. This is spoiled rotten. Oh, this one's a cat, but that we do dog also, spoiled rotten cat. And then we also have the glass jars that are a little bit smaller. Um, treat, paws off, only for the puppies. We have our standard size, nice little bite size. Um, I have a friend who has pit bulls and they absolutely love these things. Uh, they do eat two at a time because yeah, they're pit bulls. So these are kind of small for them. So we have created special request, bigger bones. This one just came out of the oven. So I'm not holding it that much because it's still a little warm. Um, this is just a, under um, an ounce and a half. And it's a nice big treat bone for your, yeah, that is warm, um, for your bigger dogs. <laughs> and they will fit in these jars as well because you can stand them up and I can stack them around. I'm guessing I can get at least two dozen in a jar, um, but we'll find out as soon as they cool enough for me to handle them. Um, but we do have the dog treats and my information is J and J Recreation. We do free porch delivery all over the Las Vegas Valley. Cash, 
uh, Venmo, Square, and now PayPal. So drop us a line, let us know what you like. Awesome. Awesome. I love that you're making those bigger dog treats because some of us have big dogs. So again, Jana will be at the November 28th show. Karen and Linda will be at November 28th and 29th. Um, that's what we know for sure. Some of our others may still hop in because we're still working through the waiting list. So I see on my computer here, which seems to be working, Debbie posted number two and Mike posted number one. I don't know if you can see my notes here. You need to just see this. Oops, where's the camera? I don't know where my camera is. Oh, there it is. In, on my notes here, uh, over here, number two says pumpkin. I know you can't see that because of my green screen. Number two says pumpkin. That means Debbie wins. Congratulations. And the answer was self-care Sunday. Self-care Sunday was the answer. All right. I don't know if Lorraine can bring back everybody on the screen so we can say goodbye. I don't have control today. This is so weird to do this without me having any control over my own show. <laughs> so Lorraine, if you can click on the speaker view and change it to the other view, if not, and then that's okay too. I thank you all for coming today and letting us uh, into your room, even with some of the technical difficulties we had. We're not perfect, things happen. It was my mess up. My computer needed apparently a long uh, reboot overdue. Um, and I used to build computers. I should have known the first thing you do is unplug, reboot, do that. That's actually the first uh, customer care we do when we, when we you know, help other people with their computers. But I wasn't paying attention apparently. I'm just glad it works again. We will be back Thursday at 6.30 p.m. with Meet the VIPs and then Saturday at um, 10 a.m. with another holiday edition, I believe. No, it's crafting gifts, crafting gifts. So it will be all kinds of stuff. And our next in-person show will be November 28, 29. We were actually supposed to be at the expo this weekend. So my phone has been popping up every day. Hey, 20 minutes to go. We would have been uh, at another venue next weekend. We would have been uh, originally at the M in two weeks. So, but we will be at Santa Fe in three weeks for sure. That will be sure three weeks for sure. And we're working on Green Valley Ranch for December 13th. It's not yet signed, but we're working on that. So we're trying to come back limited, but we are coming back, you know, a little bit at a time with all safety guidelines in place. So we're wishing you all a wonderful um, Sunday and we'll see you next week. All right. Talk to you soon. So Lorraine, you can kick us off Facebook now because I can't. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.